Mr. Rogers once said, the best teacher in the world is someone who loves what he or she does and just loves it in front of you. Our special guest today is Jenna Sagan, a wonderful educator at Grass Lake Elementary. She is so thankful for Jennifer and Meg, the two amazing moms from Kent and the whole community for marshalling to feed kids who depend on free lunch during the teacher strike in Kent. Jenna, welcome to Spirit 105.3. Thank you so much for being here. Oh my gosh, no. Thank you so much for chatting with us. This is amazing. I mean, how about Jennifer and Meg? Our minds are blown by what they've been able to accomplish already. Oh yeah, same, same. So we've had so much support, like so much support from the community, from everyone. And then all of a sudden, these two amazing moms who are from my school, so of course I'm a little biased, They, I mean, amazing. All of a sudden, like, it's all over social media that they're providing lunches for these kids, which is so needed. As you know, and you might know some of the numbers. I mean, even here at Grass Lake alone, we have like over 100 kids that qualify for free and reduced lunch. And we're a low number that qualifies the district overall. I mean, there's easily 50, over 50 percent of our district of 25,000 students that qualifies for free and reduced lunch. And they're not getting fed right now because of the strike that's happening and it's it's not okay not okay you know you know the kids how would you describe what this means to them oh it's it's great i mean you know these kids are at home right now they want to be in school just like we do food it's i mean they're eating all the time they need to be eating they're outside they're playing they're around right and they need to be fed and a lot of these kids are probably home without parents Right. They mm-hmm. um, during the summer they fed them. They could go to places provided by the school district um, that had food places, and they're not doing that right now. So they're going home or they're at home, and they're not having access to food that they've had all summer and during the school year. So these amazing women are doing this for our community. Is it's just unbelievable. It's this whole situation is not okay, but this just gives us a light that shows how much community support we have in the Kent School District and that these teachers and educators and everybody that's on the picket lines, you know, for our kids. This is why we're doing it is for our kids. And they're proving that. Jenna, you're amazing. Why do you do what you do? Oh, gosh, I love it's the kids. I'm telling you. Right. I mean, I know I can make more money working somewhere else. I know. Right. But yep. it is it's about these kids. I'm a I'm a single mom of four kids. I want them to have great teachers. I want them to have a great experience in school. I want them to learn how to learn and be, you know, functioning members of society, right? That's, yes. our, that's our goal as parents, right? And um, so I'm a teacher so that I can, so that I can do that, so I can give back. And all my teacher friends and colleagues out here are doing the same thing. We're out here. We want what's fair, you know? Yes. And um, what's fair is feeding these kids, taking care of these kids, providing them an amazing education so that they can become these amazing functioning members of society that we all want. Oh, so. Jenna Sagan, educator from Grass Lake Elementary, difference maker in our world. Thank you for catching the spirit in Kent and beyond. Thank you so much. Thank you for uh, spreading the word. We love you guys. Oh, we love you too. God bless you, dear. Thank you. Bye. Thanks. All right.